Hello, my name is Dennis Chai and I'm from Olympus Singapore. In this video, I'll present a demo on evaluating indications with TFM cursors. So first of all, you need to put up your Omni PC software. As you can see over here, we've got a TFM data file with three groups, uh, 2T, 4T and 3T. So this is the 2T, 4T and 3T. So when I click on each uh, top view you can see that there's a green dot and this indicates that I'm changing the group so let's look at the indications so the first indication would be this guy over here so you get the best signal on 4T on 2T you can see it slightly on 3T you do not see it at all so this is a, a defect that looks to be coming from the top so the second indication we see the signal best on 2T and on the third indication, we see the signal best on all of them. They all look good. So 2T signal, 4T, and 3T. Let's do the measurements from 3T. So if we see the signal on 3T, it means that we are catching it with uh, a tandem technique rebound. And uh, this is from definitely from the ID and it's pretty vertical I would think okay so first of all just right click set your reference right click again set your measurement table and just box up the indication as you would uh, on a classic face array data file so just do the height sizing like this from the back wall you can see that this guy is about 9.97 about 1 mm height Okay, so let's do the length sizing. Uh, it's a bit small, so I would actually either I would zoom or I would, I would go in uh, into a single group. So let's try the zoom. So I click here and I drag. Yep. Okay, so maybe it's a bit uh, misaligned. Let me just try to adjust it a little bit over here. Okay, click the zoom button again so you can see that the green goes off and I can continue to do my measurement. Let's put the data cursor on the strongest point like this. So for the length sizing. Okay, so you can see that the length sizing is about 6.13 and we just add the indication and we are done. Thank you.